Hello, welcome on this news training on Citrix Xen Server 8.2 LTSR. Very happy to welcome you on this training. My name is Chanesky Fabris. I'm a Microsoft Cloud Computing, Azure, and Google Certified and Trainer. And I do some training also on uh, web services, the architect courses. And I'm Citrix uh, Certified Virtualization. Here are my three children here uh, Leo 22, Raphael Nili 16, uh, and, and Marie 18. So this is, will be the outline of our course. Uh, we'll see first what is the Xen Server, Xen Server architecture. Uh, we'll see how to manage VM, virtual machine, after how to install Xen Server. After we'll see all the outfix and upgrade management. Uh, the resource pool here and load balancing, how do you group uh, you know, a lot of hosts and it's like one logical host. After that, we'll jump on networking, storage, high ability, security, optimization, and troubleshooting. So this is the outline. If you want to pass the exam, okay, you can pass this one here. So 1Y0120 Admin Citrix and Server. It will be a 90 minutes, uh, a one hour uh, question. And after you have this batch Citrix certified um, Xen Server. Wow, woohoo, that's good news for you. For the lab, it's very simple. Uh, I have rented a server. So I rented a server directly. So I have one server here. So I pay maybe uh, 45 bucks per month. Uh, it's a 6.7 6 vSphere, so uh, on my Dell PowerEdge, he has 90, 90, 95 gig of memory and I have uh, uh, 8 cores, but it's really only 4 because I have hyper-threading with on. So, and on this server, I can install directly Xen, okay? So it's very simple. If you want to install Xen on a VM, you just have to do that. Uh, we'll see, we'll cover all that, okay? But you, you just have to create a VM. Uh, put the name of your VM, uh, put Linux here, and it's going to be set OS here, uh, 664, but I can, I think you can choose another one. Do next. And, uh, and after that, uh, the only thing very important is that you can, you can put, for example, minimum four, you can put, for example, um, I don't know, 20 gig, for example, uh, of memory. And if you want to install Xen on a VM, you just have to go here and click on this one and 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 voila that's finished so we will cover how to install it but i just wanted to show you how to install on a vm xen server okay after that what you need for the for the uh for the lab is uh just uh, an active directory so this is an ldap uh 2019 server where i have installed this uh, domain learn different tech and i have some user and i have some computer okay so this one will be used if we want to join our xen to ldap okay uh, after that, I have one Windows 10 external VM, okay? So this VM will be used to connect to the internet, to install the Xen uh, Center here, uh, and to be able to upload, uh, to, yeah, to do download some hotfix, okay, only. And of course, to be able, uh, for this VM to be able to go out, because actually I cannot go out with this server, I have installed PFSense here, so it's a, a piece of software uh, with two IP, so, uh, and this, uh, uh, and this VM uh, enable me to go out um, to the internet from this VM, okay? So that's the only thing that you must have. After that, you must download, uh, let me show you from Citrix. Uh, you must download, let me show you, it's here on this VM, sorry. So to install um, Xen Server on a, on a VM, you need Xen Server, okay? So I have installed, I have this one. So let me show you. Uh, I have the install CD, okay, so it's uh, 525 uh, megabytes, actually half a gig. Uh, and here I have my update, okay, this is an update, if you want to update f uh, 7, for example, 7.1 uh, to 8 directly. This is, um, this is for conversion, and this is the, uh, the Xen tools, okay, so uh, if you have to install the Xen tools, uh, this is the Xen tools, okay, on the ISO here. And I have other one, for example, I have my um, my load balancing server, okay? This is an appliance, so you must import it here in Xen. And uh, he will do the load balancing, you know, automatically. Like, uh, for example, uh, uh, VMware update, ma not VMware manager, sorry, the vCenter, okay? When you want to do load balancing, for example. So you just need all this. Uh, if you don't have all this ISO, tell me, and I will create a share, and I will share it with you, okay? No problem. Okay, cool. So I think that it's very clear for you. I hope so. 
Um, so let's start directly with the module one. What is what is Xen Server, and uh, we'll see all the architecture of Xen Server. Ciao, ciao. Take care, and stay tuned.